so I want to talk about another Excel tip. I know we have a lot of those, but there's so many little tricks in Excel that help you work a lot faster. So today's one is something called outlines or outlining. Now I use this instead of uh, show hide, like hiding columns or showing columns. Uh, instead of that, I will use an outline. I find it easier to use. Now, with that said, if I'm actually setting out to hide the column because I actually want it hidden from someone, then I'll use hiding. But if I'm simply just wanting to get rid of some detail, show some detail, well then this is what I want to use. Now, one thing I want to point out before I start is that this gross sales here is adding up these numbers, okay? So this total is adding up these two detailed rows. This total is adding up those detail rows. And then this profit is simply taking the total sales minus the total expenses, and there's your profit. So, and we also have a calculation over in this total column. So that's the only reason this auto outline feature is gonna work. Otherwise it wouldn't, okay? It doesn't, can't read our Excel spreadsheet mind. It simply goes based on the formula. So how we do this is we would go to the data tab, doesn't matter where you clicked, go to the data tab. On the data tab, you're gonna find the group button. You're going to click the drop down arrow below group and choose auto outline. And as you can see, what it's done now is it's automatically outlined this spreadsheet. And what that means is that I can now expand and collapse the details simply with a click of my mouse. So over on the side, you see I got these little minus signs. I can click that to collapse or expand the details of those formulas, don't forget. And we have the main one, which collapses all the detail there. And we even have one in the column along the top. And so this allows me to hide details of a spreadsheet quickly so I can just see the numbers I'd want print them, send it to someone, whatever it might be. Uh, so it's a very handy feature to use uh, if you have a certain spreadsheet that would facilitate that. Now, to get rid of the outline, we're gonna click the group button again, or sorry, you're gonna click the ungroup button, pardon me, and under ungroup, you have clear outline. That basically gets you back to square one. Now, instead of using auto outline, I do wanna point out that you can do this manually. How it works 